Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can reset the email on your Apple Watch. Now you might be tempted to just uh, check out the settings on the actual Apple Watch, but there isn't really much what you can do in here. What you're going to have to do is to essentially just bring over the iPhone and play around with the settings there. And now, it, of course, it depends, like you might also do some stuff in the iPhone settings, in the Apple Watch settings. At first, what you can do is to open up the actual settings of your iPhone and not the Apple Watch. You can see I was already in the email, but I'm going to show you how you can get there. So you open up the settings and in the main section, just scroll down until you find the mail. So that is assuming that you use the built-in mail client. If not, I'm going to talk about that in just a second. So as you are in here, what you can do is like to reset it is to click on the accounts and literally just add a new account or delete that one, add something else in here. So it doesn't even have to be Gmail or iCloud. It can be literally something else. So if you click on add account, you can choose a different one. So it really depends on what you mean by resetting. Like in case you want to like delete every single messages, like every single conversation you ever had and then you will need to like go to the mail app and like delete it manually. It really depends on what you mean by reset. But in case you probably want to do like uh, just add like a new account and new emails to so, like reset it, probably just add a new one and play around with that. So make sure that you at first have it added as, a, as an account on your iPhone, then head over to the actual watch app. And if you go to the watch app, you have another set of settings here, which apply to the watch only. So again, scroll down and find the mail app. And in here, you have to like make sure you can mirror your iPhone with the notifications and stuff. But for accounts, tap on that and you can see that I have this account right here. So I can add a new one. I can play around with it. So this is the account which I have on my Apple Watch. So I have to log in and like sign in if I want to. However, I can play around with it as much as I want. So yeah, this is essentially how it works. So you can see here are all of the like mail sections and stuff. So you can play around with these settings. However, if you want to have like different and separate mail applications, you can of course go ahead and do it. Like there are definitely some mail clients, for example, Spark Mail is the one which you can use and it offers you to have an iPhone, iPad and Apple Watch app at the same time. So you literally have like a separate mailbox on your Apple Watch. So this is pretty useful and you can go ahead and like have it here have one email address under this app, another email under like another mail app. So it is up to you, but this is essentially how you can reset it. In case you wanted to know something else or some more stuff, let me know about that in the comments. But for now, thanks a lot for watching. See you guys later. Peace out until then.